The tradition of Burundian Abatani Ngoma dance, usually performed to welcome royal highnesses and special guests by the Burundi cultural group. Several Burundians living in Zambia gathered at the Kenneth Kaunda International Airport Presidential Pavilion to receive their head of state. President Evariste Ndaishimiye's plane touched down at 13.59 and was received by President Hagainde Jilema. President Ndaishimiye, who is in the country for a three-day state visit, was later accorded a 21-gun salute and a guard of honor. In speaking to journalists, the Burundian president expressed his gratitude for being invited to grace the 96th Agriculture and Commercial Show. First of all, I am very, very happy to be here. I was waiting for this nice day, and now I'm happy to be with my brother here. He's my brother, the really brother, you know. Zambia and the Burundi, Shea Doleke Tanganyika. We we are at Doed, here is at Doleg. President Daishimi highlighted the significance of agriculture for both Zambia and Burundi. You know, in our country, our slogan is each mouth must have food, each pocket money. So agriculture is important for economy of the nation. So I will, be also, I will enjoy the, this event. Earlier, Association of Burundian Residents in Zambia Chairperson, Reverend Emilia Masawarakiza, thanked the Zambian government for creating a peaceful environment for foreign nationals. For me, who has been living uh, in Zambia for the past 25 years, uh, it's, it's an honor to have the head of state come and see where um, quite a number, a number of Burundians are living. And uh, we have lived uh, among the Zambians and uh, have uh, worked among the Zambians and and uh, we have enjoyed peace and love, um, and we did it well with the, uh, the Zambian community. Later, President Daishimiye proceeded to lay wreaths at the presidential burial site. During his visit, the Burundian president is scheduled to engage in a series of bilateral meetings and grace the 96th Agricultural and Commercial Show. Mark Ziligone, ZNBC News, Lusaka.